proud of our kids for their emotional rebound that they had after um, coming after Indiana. You know, they were kind of, in my opinion, down for the past couple of days. They're kind of feeling sorry for themselves, but tonight I thought they were extremely focused. Um, we have to do much. Eventually, we have to get out of the first inning without letting the other team score. Um, we do work on that, I promise. Um, but really, for the kids that put up eight runnings or eight runs in the fifth inning like that, and just staying relaxed and having so much plate discipline, um, I'm very proud of them. Very pleased. How about Christina's at bat, and more importantly, or maybe not more importantly, but Shannon's at bat beforehand, taking fouling off two or three pitches before getting the one you want to hit. What's going on right there? You know, pitch hit at bats are very very tough and so you know, our team philosophy is just to give us three good swings and Shannon good coming in uh, to me that's play the game right there that kid coming in hadn't had a bat first game cold off the bench hadn't seen her all game for her to get a 3-2 count single the right field I mean I tip my hat to Shannon good that was a great at bat you know that really set up KB KB just kept battling 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 and you know that girl eventually missed and KB got a hold of it how does it feel when you really kind of your hit rallied the team and kind of got the momentum going what's going through uh, I mean, it's an awesome feeling. Uh, I was really, I mean, I think the, I mean, I started like the whole inning off, but I think that Shannon, good, like right before me, like had a pinch hit, base hit, and I think that just set the team on fire because like one pinch hitting is so hard to do, and Shannon's a great kid. We all love her, and that was a great hit that she got. Okay, so uh, your home run just uh, kind of one case of how the team was able to score the runners tonight on base, which you hadn't been able to do against Indiana. Do you think there was anything that meant their points into that mentally to allow the batter to clear the bases, or was it kind of just like? Um, I mean, I think any like win, there's like a small part of luck involved, but uh, I mean, I talked to you guys last week and I told you that we were going to be hungry this time we came around and played Ohio State. Um, we're, we're obviously like really disappointed in the Indiana series, but uh, Ohio State, we knew that we could like get back on track and coach always tells us about peaking at the right time and hopefully that's like what we're doing now. Kind of towards the second game with our power hand, but I mean, did you see a shift in mood on the team? Um, a little bit, not really. You know, this group again, is not really raw, raw. They're just very focused. Um, the biggest thing we're struggling with right now is I think if you've watched us play all year, they're just getting so tight. You know, we still I haven't figured out the magic formula to get them to relax and play. You know, they're just they want it so bad. You know, finally we did a team shake it off um, just to try something different, make them laugh a little bit. You know, I'm like, you guys, just the game, just get out. It's very simple. So, you know, that's going to be part of the. Uh, emotional roller coaster we're gonna have to ride and part of changing over the culture but the kids were able to do it tonight. How about Jess's pitching tonight? I mean, she only allowed she allowed six runs, but three of them were uh, only three of them were earned. How do you evaluate her pitching tonight? Phenomenal, uh, best game she's thrown all year. It was um, 
that's the Jess Cummings that we know, what we've been able to get out of her. Uh, Coach Gibson in the locker room said, you know, Jess and I, you went from a freshman to a junior and all in one night. You know, so her ability to stay relaxed and attack and have a lot of emotional maturity tonight was phenomenal. Okay. So, uh, 